We love Christmas and are feeling super festive for like a month. And what with it being Save the Children Christmas Jumper Day coming up really soon, there's no better time to get your craft on. We're going to show you how to make your own quick, cheap and unique Christmas jumpers made from jumpers that you've got lying around the house. And we've got some of our lovely Channel Mum vloggers to show you how to make some Christmas jumpers for your kids. All super simple, all super quick, all super festive. Let's get crafting! Yay! So our first Christmas jumper we make is using a long sleeve stretchy top, get them really cheap on high street and you need some pom poms and some fabric glue. We're going to make a pom pom tree, arranging them and just sticking them on basically. So all you do is before gluing them down just get your design how you like it. So I'm just arranging my pom poms and I'm going to fill up sort of the middle section of your t-shirt. So before you do any gluing pop a piece of paper in between uh, the long sleeve top so the glue doesn't seep out onto the back and then you can't pull it off. You then use some fabric glue, lift each pom-pom up, dab of glue and then stick your pom-pom down. Oh, that's so easy. And that's it. <laughs> Get four black or brown pom-poms and just stick them as a tree stump at the base of the tree and then get some really lovely sparkly yellow ones as so I get three of them and stick them at the top to look like a star. Really easy pom-pom tree. This type of jumper is all over the high street at the moment and we've done it for about a third of the price you get in the shops. For our second jumper, we found this um, knitted number and what we're gonna do is we're gonna make it a little similar to this one. We've got the word snow. We thought about ho, ho, ho and then we thought, no, no, no. And so what we're gonna do instead is we're gonna make some antlers from some gold sequins and uh, turn it into a little Rudolph. We've um, just drawn out a little antler shape onto some paper and cut it out. This way you can get a symmetrical antler. Lay the antler out on the jumper and then draw around it with uh, just a plain felt tip pen so I can get an idea of where to put my sequins. I've got this lovely, sparkly, festive uh, sequin trim which you can get in craft shops everywhere. Put a thin line of glue all the way up the antler, just until the first corner really, just otherwise it might start to dry out before you've finished. And then you take your sequin trim, just dab it onto the line. So easy. And it's like that. immediately amazing. So that's the antlers. And then to finish it, all we need to do is line up some little black buttons for eyes and a red pom-pom, because obviously he's rude on. <laughs> for his nose. He is lovely. And then uh, some fabric glue again, you need quite a bit for the buttons. And then a nose. Gently hold it up <laughs> so you can see. So there we have it, two Christmas jumpers for adults. We've got some other lovely Channel One vloggers who have done some Christmas jumpers for their little ones. Let's have a look. Are we going to make our own Christmas top? Yes. So just any old top or jumper from your wardrobe and we're going to jazz it up for Christmas. We're just using some Christmas themed foam stickers. They're nice and chunky, good for little fingers to use and it's a DIY that the kids can actually get involved in. Stick. So Santa, can we put a snowman on? This is like Mr Frosty. The good thing about this DIY is that you can reuse the top after you're finished uh, wearing it for the day. Ta-da! Yeah, looking good. Well done. Wow, Sienna, it looks so good. Ali, what are, what's on your t-shirt? Christmas tree. How many Christmas trees? Two. Two, beautiful. We're going to do some festive potato printing. One jumper, one potato, a really good knife and some paint. And it can be fabric paint but you can also use acrylic and then just iron over it to set it. We just need two brightly coloured vests. So there you have it loads of quick DIY Christmas jumper ideas. 
We hope you enjoyed watching today's Christmas countdown. We've got loads more videos to help you count down to the big day. And if you liked our video, don't forget to give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to Channel Mum or you'll miss out on all of them. Now, get crafting. Go on. <laughs>